Well, here's my ant invasion. They're coming from the side of the fridge here. And, sorry, I need to do a little touch-up paint. And, uh, they're kind of, they're less than they were because obviously they're getting in my little trap here, which is working wonderfully. And they were walking along here. And so I put another trap right there. And then they were walking along here. And here's some more here. Busy little people. Oh, people. Busy little ants. And then they're walking all along there. You can see them. If you look closely, they're down there. Here, I have another ant trap. And I don't know what, I think they went in and they ate some of the poison and they came back out because that one was full like this other one over here and now it's not full anymore. So I think they eat the poison and they take it back home and then the rest of them get poisoned. And I'm gonna go buy me some clear caulking trap all them little buggers because I don't like ants in my house they're pretty fascinating though I could just go along and kill them all right now but they're not really hurting anything they're not getting in the cupboard that I know of so um, just gonna see what happens here silly little ants thinking they can invade my house. Well, I'll show them. It's pretty crazy how many are in that trap. It's just full. Look at that. Come on camera, focus. It's full of ants. I bet you my grandson Micah would love this. He would use this as a science experiment. Mm-hmm. He would. I think they're coming out of these little holes that need to fill in. Yeah. We gotta do something about this. So that's my day this morning. I've got a few things done, but the ants kind of have hijacked me, as usual. Okay, so my friend Scott Leak said to use vinegar, so I got my uh, handy dandy little uh, bottle of vinegar here with the squirt thingy on the top because that's what I use to wash my windows with and uh, I'm gonna give her a try. I don't like using toxic stuff in my kitchen anyway. Oh, sorry ants. This is diluted because I don't wash my windows with straight vinegar but it looks like they might not like that very well. Oh, I don't really like killing things, but they're ants. Wow, that took care of them, Scott. Good job. Maybe they just drowned, though. Of course, the acid probably isn't something they really like. I got a stray here. Come on. Hmm. Wow. How about these guys over here? Ooh, we got some plentifuls. Hmm. <laughs> okay. Here. Ah. It's beside the fridge, so not enough light for the camera, but 
Ooh, I noticed when I move that trap, they get pretty discombobulated. I'm going to have such a mess to clean up. Oh well, it's Scott Leak's fault. Okay, well I gotta go, so I'm gonna come back and check out this uh, vinegar solution later. Poor ants. You can't live in the Tolbert's house. And then once I get them all cleaned up, I'm going to put some clear caulking around that, I think. The problem with that is it makes me wonder where they'll go. They'll just find another place. So. Ant infestation. Hmm. Those ones that I sprayed first didn't die. They're struggling. They're trying to crawl away. Got you again. Hmm. Well, I got things to do. I gotta go, so. Very interesting. Aren't you glad I share?